Booker. Are you afraid of God? No. But I'm afraid of you. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? I hadn't planned on it. So you expect me to shoulder What's the this? burden? No. I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I've made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do, no, but we're never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does, but there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. We've arrived. Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? Would that change anything? It might give him some comfort. At least that's something we can agree on. Hey! Is somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. There's someone inside. Excuse me, it's Booker DeWitt. I guess you're expecting me? Good luck with that, pal. Is anyone here? Hello?
love the prophet because he loves the sinner. I love the sinner because he is you. Without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? Without sin, what grace has forgiveness? Excuse me, where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. Let's keep such questions to myself, unless I want to get made. On this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Comstock. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of baptism. And lo, if the prophet has struck down our enemies at the end and not railed against the sodden beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the Sodom beneath us, but not accepted the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, it would have been enough if the prophet had just purged the vipers of the Orient, but not suffered the sacrifice of his beloved. It would have been enough if the prophet had just suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, but not expelled the vox populi. It would have been enough. Is it someone new? Someone from the Sodom below? Newly come to Columbia to be warded clean before our prophet, our founders, and our lord? I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Let's have a this or turn around and get back on that rocket. Praise be to the Might as well get it over with. Go on, brother. Hey. I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. Told you, I'm not gonna do it. Go away, Mr. Dewitt. Mr. Dewitt. No, it 
That idiot priest needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and drowning one. I need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am. To Father Franklin, a key of gold so that Eden might have industry that set her above all other nations. To Father Jefferson, a scroll so that Eden might have laws that set her above all other nations. And so each year we recommit ourselves to our founders and our prophet, Father Comstock. And, and recommit to, to our, our prophet, prophet, Father, Father Comstock. Comstock, so that we may follow in the prophet's path. Amen. Amen. Our prophet fills our lungs with water so they may better love the air. He who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and wings of angels. Watch over me and lend me strength. Shield a rebel my mind against from ignorance and, and tyranny. Share so with me your wisdom and let the light of your good judgment shine. Oh, just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. All right. So got a girl to find. Our beloved mother of forgiveness! That statue of light does not matter to a living to capture Father There's Comstock's no absolute only duty. You know, divinity. Says he's for faith, family, and fatherland. Who could be against all that? Never hire an artist, my dear fellow. They are a temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. Uh huh. I told him that the park is exceedingly far behind schedule. The, the, the landscaping is half finished. The, the statuary hasn't arrived. The fountain is full of rainwater, for God's sake. Even the marigolds are still unplanted. All work which should have been done months ago. Uh-huh. Do you know what he told me? He said that he was tired, that, that the work had taken much from him. I said, good God, man, don't tell me about details. Just get it done. Down there? Sir. And then the archangel showed a vision. A city lighter than air. I asked her, why do you show this to me, Archangel? I'm not a strong man. I'm not a righteous man. I am not a holy man. And she told me the most remarkable thing. You're right, prophet. But if grace is within the grasp of one such as you, how can anyone else? 
must not see it in themselves. It's Latin. It means... Latin. right event to attend on a day like today is serious business, you know. Can't be everywhere at once. <laughs> You'll always miss something. That's why we're going to the raffle. I have a good feeling this year. Columbia Raffle and Fair. weak in the key and the scroll, if you get my meaning. Cloud the skies, warm temperatures, and light variable winds throughout Hello. the afternoon. In short, a beautiful day for the festivities, Columbia. And now, back to the music.
Would you care for a boutonniere? We're raising money for the Girls Patriotic League. Maybe next time. You'd look dashing with one in your lapel. Come back if you change your mind. One man goes into the waters of baptism. A different man comes out. Born again. But who is that man who lies submerged? Perhaps that swimmer is both sinner and saint until he is revealed onto the eyes of man. said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Huh. Telegram for you, sir. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence. Stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77. Stop. Lutess. A good day to you, sir. Hello. friend. his fingers now would you believe me if i told you a man could hoist a one ton stallion straight into the air would you believe me well friends i am here today to tell those are no flights of fancy those are no tall tales told behind the pool hall no sir no ma'am those are biggers i'm talking about Brought to you courtesy of Mr. Jeremiah Fink himself, who amongst you has taken the divine gift of the victory. What?
Just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. Have you sampled any of the new vigors here today? I usually wait till Fink works out the kinks with them. It's safer that way. Looking to do you. Well, here's a brave fellow. 
Now, shoot the box when they appear, get it up, and you'll win a prize. I'll even throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. Oh, those bugs are quaking in their boots. A natural gunshot. A wine show. A crack show. Ah, the anarchist Fitzroy. You, sir, shall be richly rewarded. Well, here's a brave fellow. Now, shoot the box when they appear, get it up, and you'll win a prize. I'll even throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. Another shot right on the button. Well done, sir. shall be richly rewarded. With a beloved spouse? Well, it's time to take back control from the men of metal. With possession, you are the master. You will bend any machine to your will. Give me one of those. With just a whisper, they're all ears. <laughs> Press to turn machines into allies. What the hell was that? Come on, let me through. Heads. Or tails. Huh. Tails. I told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. Bless her and keep her. This little beauty? Ah, the 
whole division got them. If we're going to flush the Vox out of the Skyline system, we got to have the best. Uh, they got any openings in the group? I'd love to bust some Vox skull. <laughs> your books on the sciences. Mama says it's not a fit occupation for a lady, but I think she's jealous of our cleverness. Is it true that only you were allowed to visit the girl in the tower? If the lamb is lonely too, I should like to meet her, as we would have much in common. Warmest regards, Constance. a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? 77. 77. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me the bowl! Is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of Colombia? <laughs> all right, then. The winner is number 77! Oh, what do you know? Number 77, come and claim your prize! First round! You fucked It was me! It was all me! Please! Please! Please, what are you doing? Come on! Are you gonna throw it? Or are you taking your coffee black these days? <laughs> Oh, looks like we've got a shy one here. <laughs> we've got to do something about that. We got something for you, son. Of a bitch. Wait, wait. <laughs> it's him. <laughs> now, where'd you get that brand, boy? Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show them what we got planned, boys!
I told you, Comstock. You sell them paradise, and the customers expect cherubs for every chore. <laughs> no menials in God's kingdom. <laughs> well, I have a man in Georgia who leases us as many Negro convicts as you can board. Why, you can say they're simple souls in penance for rising above their station. <laughs> Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. Hot. What's going on? Wasn't no sample. 